craft that entered the war zone around Britain. And whereas in March 1915, the German cruiser sank the William P. Fry, a private American vessel. On May 7, 1915, the British owned Lusitania Ocean Liner was torpedoed without warning off the coast of Ireland. Of the 1,959 passengers, 1,198 were killed, including 128 Americans. And in November 1915, Germany sunk an Italian liner without warning, killing 272 people, including 27 Americans and 28 sailors. And whereas in 1917, Germany announced the resumption of unrestricted warfare in war zone waters. Whereas three days later, the United States broke diplomatic relations with Germany, and in the hours following that, the American liner whose satanic was sunk by a German U-boat. And whereas on February 22, 1917, Congress passed a $250 million arms appropriations bill intended to make the United States ready for war, and in late March, Germany sunk four more U.S. merchant ships. And whereas on April 2, 1917, President Wilson appeared before Congress and called for a declaration of war against Germany, and on April 6, 1917, Congress declared war against Germany. And whereas on June 26, 1917, the first 14,000 U.S. infantry troops landed in France to begin training for combat, and the United States' entrance in the war would prove to be a major turning point. And whereas the World War I ended on November 11, 1918, with the United States having mobilized 4 million soldiers, with 116,708 U.S. military personnel dying during the war. Now, therefore, be it resolved that the Board of Selectmen of the Town of Belmont joins with the town in commemorating the centennial of the end of World War I while honoring those who served. On November 14, 2018, Board of Selectmen, Adam Dash, Sheriff, Mark A. Palilla, Vice Chair, Tom Caputo, Selectman.